Hello, it's your boy Nick Avelli. You on Nick Avelli TV. Make sure y'all like and subscribe. Listen, um, word is that um men that are net fans did a wonderful job with their girlfriends and wives on Father's Day. Like they stayed home, they was playing with the kids. And you know, they had that family time going on. Makes you wonder though. Don't be so quick to give them credit, y'all. Especially when they haven't been doing nothing for the kids all year round. Let's not forget that the Nets lost the day before Father's Day. So if you find your man, your boyfriend spending time, most likely he was afraid to come outside. Now, I could be wrong. I could be wrong. You know, we got some good men out here who do love their children. But if you're the type of woman that have to have your man be forced to be around his kids, and then all of a sudden... You happen to see him around y'all with the kids and acting like a family man. Like he want to spend time with you. But he hasn't been doing that all year round. And he's a Nets fan. I'm going to let you in on a little secret. The Nets lost so he was scared to be ridiculed. So he made an excuse to spend some family time with the children and wife. I know it sounds fucked up but the truth is the truth. Listen, I'm going to be on you net fans next. All summer. Mm -hmm. I'm going to do that. Why, Nick Avelli? Because it feels good. It feels good to shit on net fans. And y'all don't have nobody to blame. But Kevin Durant, he did this shit. He came to the city of New York after saying the Knicks is not a cool team to play for. Who does that? Who does that? That's like a blood wanting to be invited to a crib party. It don't go together. Water and electricity don't go together. But hey, it is what it is. So today is officially Father's Day for Net fans because they wasn't able to enjoy Father's Day when it took place. Imposters. Fake Nick fans. And now we want to act like we got love for the family, right? Hmm? Oh shit, why y'all got me started, man? It feels good to be a Knicks fan and be able to shit on a team that's supposed to have the Big Five. Um, we're supposed to have a parade in New York. The Nets was supposed to do it because y'all got so sick and tired waiting on the Knicks to do it. Hmm? And look what happened. You got New Yorkers happy as hell. And we went to the playoffs. Hmm? We only won one game. Which, by the way, was done on purpose. Let's stop worrying about what happened to Julius Randle game. Nothing happened to him. Coach Dibbs is a fucking genius. He told Randle, listen, we did what we had to do. Now it's time to get players to play for us. We made the playoffs. We already shut the haters up. Yeah, we, we shut them up when we made the playoffs. That was our championship, y'all. Going to the playoffs. I know that sounds crazy, but to a Knicks fan, they, we understand what I'm trying to say. We in rebuild mode. Brooklyn Nets, that's just been destroyed. Nothing happening. It's over with. Bye-bye.